Are you unhappy with the way your Facebook page is laid out? Maybe there's parts that you would rather highlight and you just don't know how to fix that. I'm Cheryl Locke with Ginger Roots Media and in this video, that's what I'm going to show you how to do. We're going to go to your Facebook page and I'm going to show you where Facebook offers you 10 templates. Yes, they have 10 templates you can choose from. So you may want to highlight your videos. You may want to highlight your services, your products. There's a few options back there. And not only that, but you know the tabs that are over there on your left hand side? We're going to show you how to rearrange those too. So it makes it easier for people when they come to your Facebook page. That stuff is on top that you want them to see first. We don't want it hidden down below. We want to move it so it stands out as the first thing they see. So let's head over to Facebook and we're going to learn how to change a template. Okay, here we are on my Off the Jacks Facebook page. And we're going to go in and change the layout. First, let's look at what we have. As you scroll down the page, you're going to see I have services first. Then I have my reviews. Then photos. Videos. A couple of posts, the most recent post. And then I have upcoming events. Now, if you look over on the left hand side, you're going to see home, which is the front of your page, services, reviews, offers, which I'm not showing. I'm going to show you how to take that off too. Photos, videos, posts, and events. So it runs on this side the same as it does out here. All right. So if I want to change this layout, we're going to do that right now by simply going up to the top right and click settings. Okay, here we are on the settings page. Over on the left, you're going to see templates and tabs. Okay, I am running the services template right now. If I want to change that, I simply click edit. And as you will see, here's the services, movies, business, venues, nonprofit, politicians, restaurants and cafes, shopping video page, and standard. Now, any of these that you might want to see, just click view details. And there you're going to get a brief little message of what it's about because you're going to have highlights on your menu, your hours, and your location. And it's going to show you what tabs you get. If you would like to change to that, you can hit apply template and it'll go right to that template immediately. Now, it's super easy to change these. If you don't like it, change it back to what you had. Now for the tabs, I do not use the default tabs. I never have. I pick my own. But here is where they are listed. And as you can see, the services, reviews, offers, photos. That is just like what we had over here on the left hand column. Now, let's see offers. I don't need offers right now. I click settings, show offers tab. I can turn that off. That way it will no longer show out on the front of my page. Click save. Now, let's say that I want to send someone straight to my events listings. Click in here and right here is the URL to go to your events. You can do that for any of these. So if you have something special, special you want to send people to, go in and get that direct URL. Now let's say that since I have some events coming, I want to put them higher on my list. I'm going to take it, grab it, and drag it up. All right, now I have my events first. Okay, you can also add a tab if you'd like to. If you click add a tab, 
It'll give you different options that you don't already have on your page. Just simply click Add, go into your settings, make sure it's on, move it where you'd like. Now, since I did move the events up to the top, let's go over here to my page and I'll refresh. And now you can see the events are now up at the top. So as we scroll down, we did have services first. Now I have events first. So this is a way that you can move these around. Something special comes up. You want to put them up at the top for a little while. You can do that. Maybe you have a special offer that you do want to show the tab and put it at the top or services, special pictures, whatever you may have. It's just pretty easy. You're going to go to settings and you're going to go over to template and tabs and then start editing from there so you can get the page you're happy with. Okay, there you have it. Now you can go in and change these templates at any time. I've never had an issue with changing them too often or anything else. So if you pick one and it's not working for you or you're not getting the response you want, maybe try another one. As far as the tabs on the left, go ahead and move those around and see if you can't get people to your products, your services, whatever it is that's most important to you that they find. Thanks for watching. Be sure to hit the subscribe button, hit the little bell, you might get a notification. And if nothing else, share this with your friends that also have Facebook pages.